Today we're gonna be looking at Bruh. some scary videos. And you already know, boy, you better that out of here. Everybody, please just do me one favor. And this favor could possibly save the planet. Just click the subscribe button <coughs> in five seconds. Go, go, go. Five, four, three, two, one. Did you do it? Okay, all right, all right, we're good, we're good. And yeah, comment down below something scary. You can put gas stations. You can put gas prices. Or you can put gas. Let me know. And let's go! Oh. La Yarona caught on tape. Um. <gasps> I would never drive down those creepy dark roads, man. Run her over! I'm sorry, run it over! Oh, bro, bro. You really just going back up? I'm going full speed, baby, fast and furious. I'm just going... Argh! She looks like the type of woman that will trick you into marrying her. She'd be like, oh, let's go out to lunch. And then you show up and it's a wedding ceremony. I'm sorry, girl, but I want a divorce, all right? You, you take the kids, all right? Jeez. I'm telling you, man, you should have you ran her over when you had the chance. It's too late now. If you look behind you, I guarantee you she's in the back seat. There is this freeze frame of a video that was captured inside of an abandoned hotel that still has no explanation. This was the freeze frame that was captured by Carrie Layton in 2016. She had ventured in to explore the Clairvant Hotel, which is an abandoned hotel located in mid-state Missouri. While she's a vlogger and she's really well known for exploring places like this all around the country, she entered this hotel herself, just in the hopes that she would film content and she would capture some videos. And while she was filming, she actually never even noticed that there was somebody else there with her who was watching her from above the balcony. She only caught this frame for a second in the video after after she watched her footage back when she left the hotel. Whatever she saw in there, it was clear she was not alone. What? Girl! That's the face you saw when you looked up? Mm -mm. Why does that thing look like a disappointed parent? Did you get D's on your report card? That's why that thing's so angry. He said you better get your grades up. <laughs> Jeez. But seriously, if I saw that thing, I guarantee you I'm gonna throw my iPhone at his face. Maybe not my iPhone because I need that, you know, you know, I got all my informations in it. I might actually take off my hat and throw it at his face. Aw, having a dance party. Come on, everybody. Let's do it. Woo! Hey, look. <gasps> Wait, what? Uh, girl. What are y'all playing, Uno? Playing, playing some, some go fish? Nah, y'all playing Uno. What is wrong? Oh! <gasps> the crazy ghost taking her away. Would y'all grab her? Grab her! What are y'all doing? Y'all, okay, actually, that's what I would have done. That's exactly what I would have done. I can't even lie. Ew. You should have ran out the front door, though. Definitely should have ran out the front door. This is chaos. What kind of sleepover are y'all having? A haunted demon ritual sleepover? This girl is literally getting dragged because she made you draw two, and then she skipped you. Oh, girl, you about to get skipped all over the tile. Dang, that thing dragging you all the way into the kitchen. I don't know what demon you done made mad, but you need to make amends. Don't play demons in Uno, okay? They hold a grudge. And right now, they holding your ankles. Ah, things humans were never meant to see. It was a dinosaur. Okay. Sir, what are you doing? Experiment shows how intense radiation heat can leave behind a shadow. Wait for it. Um. After a few days, the man died, but they said it had nothing to do with this experiment. Wait, what the? You forgot something. You literally forgot your shadow. Your shadow's right there. Ugh. Yeah, intense radiation heat can do that, and it can also cause some serious health problems. So, hate to say it, man, but it's probably not worth the, uh, yeah, it's not worth the experiment. I swear, that shadow's like, what are you doing, bro? Uh, you forgot me. Why'd you have to make that pose? You could have done something a little bit better. Come on, get creative, my boy. This is why these old cathedrals freak me out. So in Loudon, France, in the 1600s, there was this cathedral. And one day, all of the nuns that worked there were complaining about having the same nightmare. All of them were seeing this shadowy figure that they referred to as the Cloth Man. He would appear angelic at first, but then would quickly turn demonic. 
This was terrifying the nuns, but it started getting so much worse. See, after these nightmares started happening, the nuns started showing symptoms of demonic possession. Mass hysteria broke out, and some of the nuns were able to bend over backwards so their shoulders were touching their ankles. Ugh. It was also said that others were caught levitating. But these nuns thought they knew who was doing this to them. The head priest at this cathedral was a man by the name of Father Grandier, and he was accused of practicing black magic. Racism. He was eventually burned at the stake, but they were not able to exorcise the demons out of the nuns. And in fact, many of the men who tried to perform exorcisms suffered horrible fates, even claiming that Grandier's ghost was tormenting them from beyond the grave. Wait, what? Oh my god. I swear, I ain't going to no cathedra ca cathedrals. This dude was practicing black magic? Wow, this ain't Harry Potter. Who practices black magic? Like, like really? Imagine if you knew somebody was just like, I'm a practicing the black the magic. I'd be like, man, if you don't get your butt out of my car and give me some gas money, that's scary and ridiculous. Don't mess with the nuns, all right? Don't mess with the nuns. Don't mess with the dang priests. And I'm serious, girl. When are you going to ask me out on a date? We can go to Denny's. You like Denny's? Nope. She don't like Denny's. Ah! How can I help you? Open the door, please. No. <laughs> Heck. What on earth is you look that? Like an alien. <laughs> Can you please open the door, Noah? Girl, I ain't opening squat. Only thing I'ma open is an account so that you can put some medical insurance money up in there. You need to go to the hospital. You need to see a doctor. You need to see a psychiatrist. I'm not trying to give you a prognosis, but girl, like, like, you're clearly crazy. Look at those eyes. Those eyes have seen some stuff. Those are the eyes of somebody who's possessed. Open the door, please. No, I ain't opening jack. This ain't the drive through window. Like, girl, we're not here to take your order. You ain't about to get a double cheeseburger with fries and milkshake and apple pies. You ain't gonna get that out of me. You know what you're gonna get? You're gonna get a slap. Wait, I mean, wait, no, 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 no. You know what you're gonna get? You're gonna get a, uh, uh, can people still spank? Is spanking still a thing or is that bad? That's bad, bad, bad. If you are inside your home with the lights out, do not look outside your window. Turn on your lights before you look through any window. Okay. Do not leave <gasps> your home if you see a figure outside. Even if he is turned Ew. away, do not look at him. Lock all doors and windows before turning off all the lights inside you your doing? residence. Hide in a small space and call authorities. Do not move from hiding unless you hear an unfamiliar voice. If you do hear a familiar voice coming from inside your Ew. home, do not move. He is inside. He is inside. He is inside. Okay, girl, you do that face way too well. That is scary. Girl, is that a filter or is that just your face? I can't tell. If you crawl in like that, girl, I'm gonna give you the biggest boot to the face you've ever seen. I guarantee you I'm gonna knock out all your teeth. Don't be scaring me like this, girl, okay? Like, like, whose roommate is this? This girl needs to be medicated and she needs to be drug tested immediately. Somebody send her to the gulag. Does this photo give you the same kind of eerie feeling it does for me? This is a still recovered from a camcorder found in 2004 that belonged to Henry Peterson of Clear Lake, Iowa. And the story behind it is bone chilling. He had been making comments of this strange noise that was coming from the woods of his backyard and there were insane amounts of animals that were being found killed. He just had no idea what animal could be doing this because the killings were really bizarre. Like animals missing their feet and hands Ew. bizarre. Curious about this animal, Henry decides he's actually going to go into the woods himself. He ends up taking a camcorder with him and he was armed expecting to find some kind of animal out there but he did not expect this. A person in a mask in those woods. And despite being armed he might have been in shocked he did not fire at this person when he charged at him and the camera. The video allegedly cuts but Henry was found the following morning in pieces with his hands and his feet missing. That was the last his family ever saw of him when he left the porch that night. So who was this? No! It's Jason from the movies. Remember like Freddy versus Jason? It is Jason. What's that camp called? Camp Green Lake or, or something like that? Man, you better get up on out of there. Why are you wearing a hockey mask? Don't you know hockey season is over? Imagine if you see this dude at the drive-thru trying to take my order. I'm like, bro, it ain't Halloween. I'm gonna need you to uh, take that mask off. Do me a favor and be normal. How about that? And look at my man at the bottom. We caught you when you half blinking. Half blinking, looking like you've been drinking. Mm -mm, what a shame. Get it together, man. Come on, sobriety is important. But if you enjoyed this video, then go ahead and smack that like button. And yeah, I'ma see ya in the next one.